Good morning, everybody, and welcome back to P with Joe. You might know Joe Wicks as the British fitness guru who rose to fame with his live stream lockdown PE lessons. Unfortunately, Joe couldn't make it today, so I have stepped in. I'm Spider-Man. When the world stopped, Joe made it his mission to keep millions of families moving. To lift up your mood, to boost your energy, and to really hopefully help improve your mental health through this time. And while lockdowns are thankfully over, he's still motivating fitness newbies and veterans alike, one burpee at a time. How you chose this, you wanted a challenge, stay with me. Now Joe's touring Australia, determined to get us all up off the couch. Three, two, one, let's go! Joe Wicks himself joins us now on the desk. Hey, Joe, welcome. Thank we, you so much. We have two of the fastest runners in the world on the desk tonight. There they are. Yeah, right. That's, they're, they're in the green room at the moment. Look at them. Did you uh, turn up thinking that you were going to be the <laughs> Yeah, the those boys can run. They're like Olympic, you know, 100-metre sprinters. I'm not that quick. I can do a few burpees fast, but no, I'd never catch up with them too. Oh. Did you challenge them to a quick burpee off in the green room, or is that uncool? No, I just sat there eating the fruit, really, just chilling out in the back room. The fruit? <laughs> yeah, They've got they're... chips and chocolates and I all kinds of stuff I didn't see them. I just saw a big platter of fruit, which I got, I got stuck into. Well, that's oh. good. You're doing uh, a workout show at Taronga Zoo, which yeah. is very exciting. Did you see a few, like, some lions recently escaped from Taronga Zoo. Did you know that? I didn't hear that story, but I'm actually staying there this weekend with my kids, so I hope they've gotten oh. back in the cage, oh, right? Yeah, yeah. yeah. But do you think that was all a ploy? Like, if you were doing a workout show there and then the lions escaped, that's a way to get people running, right? I mean, I don't know what you do. Yeah, you'd have to climb a tree and run, a, run for your life. But did they catch them and they put them back in the cage safe? Yeah. No one got hurt, right? No, no one got hurt. No, no there's still one on the loose. I'm, there's a hotel. <laughs> Let us I'm, know if you find it. I'm staying in there this weekend with my wife and kids, so I've got a brand new baby, so let me know if there's any on the loose, right? Well, just put your baby in the tree. Fine. It's <laughs> be sorted. Hey, could you Presumably, the last time you were in Australia, well, when you were here when you were 18, it was very different from this time. But I'm just trying to imagine you as a backpacker. Were you the type to get loose and do shoeys, or were you the type who was always annoying and, come on, everybody, let's get up and do some burpees? No, I tell you what, I definitely, done, I definitely didn't do a shoey, but we used to do these... Um, we used to call it a high pour. You get those, bo you know, those boxes of wine. Is it goon juice? They call yeah, it. Yeah, yeah. yeah. And you just, you know, stand at the top. You'd hang it. You'd hang it up at the top of the bed, and you'd open the tap, and you'd sit oh, there like that. Yeah. So I definitely had a few drinks. But yeah, no, I've been, I've always loved fitness. But I still, you know, when I was in Australia, I still parted for sure. I actually met my girlfriend at the time um, in Cheeky Monkeys, a bar in Byron Bay. They've actually oh, shut it down, really? but yeah, it's a shame they've closed it down recently. But I actually, um, yeah, used to dance on the table, get drunk. It was pretty wild back then. That's 2005, that was. And now you can't return to the scene of the crime. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> um, you mentioned you were into fitness even then, though, you said. Why, why does exercise matter so much to you? So, yeah, look, the reason I'm in Australia is really to, you know, promote exercise, especially around, amongst young people, because I really am so passionate about you know, how exercise makes us feel, how, how much you know, it can improve our mental health, uh, reduce anxiety, depression, all these things that young people are experiencing. Because as a child, I grew up in a household with addiction. You know, my mum had severe OCD and eating disorders. My dad was a, a, dr a drug addict. So for me, it was a very unstable, chaotic home life. And mm -hmm. I just always remembered that when I did PE or any kind of exercise, it was like I released that anxiety and fear and tension from my body. And so I've really used it as a coping mechanism all my life. So when you see me, you know, jump around on TV as a panda bear or dressed up as, a, as Harry Potter, it's because I'm trying to engage young people in exercise and make it fun for them. If you were... If you knew someone really lazy, <laughs> but someone who still wanted to look all right and wanted to get fit quickly, what's the, what's the quickest, easiest, most effective exercise you can do for, like, three minutes a day. <laughs> well, I mean, my workouts are usually sort of 15 to 25 minutes long, but, you know, that's why I've got the app, the Body Coach yes. app. It's incredible. So it's really like about short workouts, short recipes, and, and fitting into your life, but also seeing it differently, right? It's not about weight loss and losing inches. It's about your mental health, isn't it? It's about how you feel. It's about losing stress and anxiety. Like, it's all these things that we experience. So it's really about shifting your mindset from it being about body image. And when you start to do it every day because you feel good and you feel energised and you sleep better, then you, then you get the transformation that you're after, you know. But it does take a bit more than three minutes a day. Damn. Well, <laughs> you, you can head to our Hang website. On, I didn't name you. <laughs> you can head to our website for details on how to get tickets to the PE uh, jo with Joe tour. Uh, Joe Wicks, thanks so much for joining us. Thank you us. so much. Right. Appreciate Thank it. You.